Hello, every pony, every brony, and every fan. Um, I'm just gonna start out saying that if I upload this video, it is for 510 likes on my Facebook page. But this will not have to do with my little pony friendship is magic per se. If you understand what I'm going for here. Today is a nostalgia trip to the past. I have a bin here that I found under my bed that is full of toys from when I was little. So I'm going to show you <laughs> some of those toys. Um, like I found the case to my Harry Potter coins. The other two are like up on a shelf somewhere. <laughs> and I, I lost the case and I found it, so. Yay! So I'm going to put that aside. But, um, but this whole, um, video is going to be on toys that I had when I was little that got stuck in this box. <laughs> like, um, here's my Mulan doll. This isn't her original dress. It's actually to my other Mulan doll. Um, her hair is really messed up. <laughs> But she's just a normal little Barbie doll, but she has like this little black smudge on her face. Yeah. <laughs> um, here's one of my favorite Barbie dolls when I was little. I kind of always kept her in these clothes, like these big bell bottoms and like this little like um, half shirt. And her hair's always been like this, and I used to keep it like really styled and really pretty, and now it's just kind of afro attack. Um, but I liked her because she had the more bendy arms and legs and such, so she could do more. Um, here's my other Mulan doll. <laughs> yes, her hair is short because she, what, um, what happened was she had like, like a weave almost that she would like attach to her hair so she could have long hair and then you would cut it off with the sword and then she was a guy you know like in the movie but it never really went down and it always just kind of stuck out like that <laughs> and of course she's not in any original clothing um i really loved these horse i really loved horses when i was little and these oh yeah the magnets still work and they can kiss, and they're, these two were in a set together, and they were mommy and stallion cult thing. Um, I don't know why this one has two coats on, but, <laughs> oh well. Um, and then these were in a set together, and I only had two of these sets. Um, oh, and let's see if I can get them to do it. Nope, the thingies wore out. But it used to, like, you would press them down, and then they would slowly come up like they're stretching. But they have the magnetic thing, too. But she has, like, this little capey collar thingy on, so it can't really happen. Let's see if it works on the other one. Oh, it might. Oh, 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 it did, kind of. You can hear it. Um... Random oven mitt. Um, I think my gran granny gave that to me. Oh lord. <laughs> really old picture of me. Um, this is a Hot Wheels truck. It's just a normal red truck. I never opened it for some reason. It says Custom 69 Chevy. And it was mood in 2001. Oh lord, these things scared the heck out of me. They're really rubbery. Like, this is like, you know, Charlie the Unicorn? Or like, llamas with hats? It's like, those two had a baby. Um, the worst part about them is their heads easily just kind of went pop. The blue one, if it's still in here. Because there was two of them. Um, yeah, that's definitely going in the trash. 
this horse over here has a very special history. I think my Nana gave it to me. And then its tail fell out. <laughs> and it's clearly a boy. Um, and then, like, I was super little and she gave it to me. So, like, the feet are all too <laughs> But it has a really soft, fuzzy pink mane. Um, oh, and this is one of my mom's horses. If I can get her untangled. She has a bridle attached to her tail. This is one of my mom's horses that she had when she was really little. It's lost a back foot. Um, um, it's really fragile. Her hair is like in shambles. But this is like my first horse that I remember really playing with. And this horse, um, let me see if I can find the other piece. Like, you could switch out his tail and stuff. Like, see? And then you just put it in the hole. And, uh, <laughs> you could take off the mane and put in this. Oh, it's the other way. My bad. And now he has, like, this afro curl. But most of the time, I kept him with this hairstyle just because he was a man. And I can't even remember how to put the hair in now. There we go. Uh, I kept it in that because it was easier to take care of, and it made him look more like a boy instead of this. Um, Care Bear keychain. <laughs> Saddle. Saddle. Bridle. A clippy thing. I might use that for my ponies. Um, a special story about this horse. Not really the saddle. But, um, I was on the way to Texas and we went to Dairy Queen and I got him. And he was my friend for the whole trip through Texas. Yay. Um, now these were in a doll house that I had when I was little that we had to get rid of recently. Um, but it came, like, with a dad and a kid and another kid and a horse and, like, all kinds of stuff. And these were the twins. And they they had red hair, but everybody else in the house had blonde hair. And I was just kind of like... Like, I didn't really re realize it until I was kind of older. And then I was like, how does that work? <laughs> um, but here's the mommy. And she always has this little skirt on. Well, this was like her pretty skirt. Ah, okay. Her normal skirt's under it. Haha. <laughs> See? It's kind of like this dingy, like, little housewife dress. That's like, la la la. I have an ascot. And, and earrings. And I'm so pretty. And their heads, like, had, like, this little, like, swivel system going on. This one has the worst. She's like a bobblehead. It just shakes all over the place. But this was one of the little kids. And here's one of the little cats. It came with like 12 cats, I swear. They were cat people. Um, this was like my favorite Kelly doll. Because she had like this little ballerina hair thing. And then, um, this is some other Kelly's dress. But you could turn her into a mermaid. Uh... Yeah, he got chewed on a lot. I didn't like him. Here's other creepy! <laughs> um, now, some of these you will not get to see until next video. Because they're going to be um, in a video kind of like how I got into My Little Pony. Um, so you can guess what they are. Yep, that's right, they're hobbits. Um, here's another little horse that has like a string shoelace actually wrapped around him. Um, Harry Potter chess piece. Uh, this gigantic saddle. I don't know why I have one this big. I don't remember what horse it went to. 
Um, but yeah. Oh, found a yo-yo. <laughs> nice, are you really good at yo-yos? Woo, but I'm sitting down. I think I might keep this. <laughs> but, um, I hope you enjoyed this little, this, this little adventure to the past. Because <laughs> I can't talk today. Um, so if you liked toys when you were little, which I hope you did, either that or you had an awful childhood. Um, what was some of your favorite toys that you played with? Um, did you like Barbies? Did you play with cars? Um, did you like, uh, My Little Ponies when you were little? Did you like cars? I already said cars. Um, I'm trying to think of more boy toys. Oh, did you play with G.I. Joes? I know I did. Um, The Little Green Army Men, Monkeys in a Barrel, uh, <laughs> Mr. Potato Head. Uh, what did you play and... Well, what was your favorite toy? Did you have, like, a certain Barbie doll that you would carry around with you? Or uh, a certain monster truck that you would take with you everywhere? Or anything? <laughs> anything? <laughs> well, um, I'm gonna go, and I kind of want to burn these. <laughs> but it would probably be horrific. Like, I think... The main would burn, and then this would just be like, haunt my dreams. Like, do you not see how creepy this is? Come play with me. I'm a pony. Trust me. <laughs> On that note, I think I will leave. So, thank you for watching this video, and look forward to my next video, which will probably be a lot shorter, of how I got into My Little Pony. And I'll talk to y'all later. I love y'all. Bye. Bro hoof. <laughs>